Hi Geminis, this week we have got a little bit more of a relaxed week than last week. We obviously had our Valentine's union of Venus and Mars last week, which you can still read about uh, on the blog below. So if you have uh, a relationship this week, this is a time of forgiveness because we've just moved into Pisces season. Um, and even if you're single as well, this is also a time of forgiveness, but it might be a time for forgiving yourself for something, having compassion for yourself and allowing yourself to be who you want to be, to be who you really are without so much judgment and so many shoulds right so Pisces season is a really dreamy kind of time where we delve into our subconscious we have maybe more psychic abilities than usual you know we kind of get a little bit like uh, into the unknown and so you might find yourself drawn into observing yourself and allowing yourself to kind of flow in a way that makes you feel good about life. Maybe you want to start connecting with divine a little bit more. Uh, maybe you want to practice some tarot or some astrology, something that kind of uh, takes the boundaries off of reality and kind of gets you into a more magical frame of mind. So let's see what your cards are this week. Okay, we've got two sevens have just jumped out there. So we've got the Seven of Wands and the Seven of Swords. And so this is saying that um, you've got some challenges in your life at the moment. This might be challenges with other people. You're not trusting uh, other people. You're not trusting someone or you're not trusting life to give you the opportunity to trust people, actually. Um, and it seems like, you know, at every turn, there's something that, you know, is a, a challenge in your relating skills and a challenge in your life. And so this is saying, actually, Pisces season is that time to find faith because Pisces is all about faith um, and you know that can be very hard it's not like an overnight decision where you just go okay now have faith um, but actually this is a time to kind of explore you know the meaning behind these experiences what are the lessons behind these experiences you know there might have been challenges that kind of took you away from something that wasn't meant for you and so therefore that was in your highest interest um, and so this is a really positive time for you to kind of look into that and heal some of this. So let me know in the comments if it resonated. Otherwise, you can book readings and read the blog from the links below. Subscribe and I'll see you here next week.